Hi all, welcome to the next in the series, Understanding and Using Excel. This time we'll look at how to create a form for easy data entry in larger spreadsheets. In this particular example, we, we're looking at eight or nine uh, columns suitably headed uh, with some records already entered in directly into the cells. That's fine, except that if you have uh, larger spreadsheets, particularly where you might have 30, 40 or 50 columns or so, uh, it can get a bit tricky to keep track of where you are in the cells. There's a simple solution. I can create a form to use to enter data, and it works like this. First of all, it's a good idea to make sure that you already have one record already entered. Then I can click in any cell in the record, and at the end of the quick access toolbar up here I'll see that there is a drop arrow that I can click we'll look at that shortly and um, then I'll be able to choose more commands which we'll see then I'll click the drop arrow again and choose all commands in the window that pops up then I simply scroll down to form and click add and OK and then you'll see a form button up in that quick access toolbar at the top left hand corner of the screen and I can use it to add a new record. So I'll show you how to find records also using the criteria button. So let's see how it works. First of all I've made sure I've clicked on any cell in uh, the records. Then I click the drop arrow up here, go down to more commands, then I click the drop arrow here and go to all commands. Then I scroll down until I come to the F's where I will find the button called Form. Uh, it's up a little bit, just went too far. There we go there, Form. And I click Add and OK. And there I see the extra button up in my quick access toolbar called Form. To add a new record, I simply click on the Form button and I'll click uh, New, that gives me all the blank fields but suitably labelled here and uh, we'll enter one new record in, we'll say uh, Mary Tab takes me down to the next field Tab again, we'll say she lives in number 4 Mary Street Tab, Marysville Postcode will say uh, 56789, or zip codes as they're often referred to. Home phone 9876543. Uh, no mobile phone. Uh, she was born on the 21st of September uh, 1990, and her occupation is housewife. Some people say home duties, I say housewife. And then I can close and I'll see that Mary has been entered in there. So the form lets me see one record at a time on the screen here. You can imagine if you're down entering data into row uh, uh, 500 that this might be an easy way to do it. Let's say I want to find a record. I want to find Harry Thompson here in my form. So I'm going to click on the criteria button and I'll say first name Harry and if there is more than one Harry, which there may well be, I might need to type a little bit of extra information. Harry Thompson, uh, find the next uh, record of Harry Thompson. There he is. And now, if I wish, I can delete him or just look at the uh, information in his record. So I'll, I'm going to delete Harry and it's going to say uh, uh, do you want to permanently delete the record? Remember a permanent deletion cannot be undone. So I'm going to click OK and Harry is dispatched uh, to the ether. I'll now click close and there are my, uh, my records. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to uh, subscribe to the channel where you'll be automatically notified of lots more Excel hints, tips, tricks and procedures. Thank you for watching.